Hello there and welcome to today's video. In this video, I'm going to share with you some tools and exercises to help you get through the summer heat, to help you keep your heart cool and your energy balanced. But before we begin, if you're new to my channel, my name is Kseni, and on this channel, I share Qigong inspired videos, breathwork exercises, and meditation to help you feel and do better physically and mentally. You have a lot to discover here on YouTube, but if you're looking for more structured videos or would like to join me live every Sunday on Zoom, consider joining my membership site. You can find how to join in the description below this video. Go ahead and get ready and let's begin today's practice. Today's session is about balancing your heart. According to traditional Chinese medicine, the summer season is associated with the fire element and is corresponding to the heart and small intestine. With a lot of heat outside, we also can build a lot of heat inside. So we need to make sure that we keep the energy of the heart nice and cool, nice and balanced, nourishing the yin energy of the heart. So we're gonna start with the acupressure. I find this point very, very uh, useful, especially during hot days. This point is called Nei Guan, the internal gate. And it's located three fingers down from your wrist line, right in the middle of your inner forearm, between the tendons and the bones. So if you just put three fingers down, find it, and then find a position that is comfortable, whether you're seated, whether you're standing, making sure your shoulders relaxed. Kind of lock it from both sides and press gently for 36 times. As you press in this acupressure point, notice your breath. See if you can also calm your breath a little. Be firm but gentle. You don't want to build up extra tension in your other hand. If you're doing this practice and it's already hot, take your effort to probably one third of what you usually do. Just stay soft, stay cool. Very good. Slow it down. Take a moment to feel the little tingling, feel the energy being activated. And then lift from the wrist. Begin to relax the tissues, the muscles around your elbows. Stay calm, stay relaxed. Your breath is natural. You're enjoying yourself. Feels good to be moving. Good. Once more, relax. Already begin to expand the awareness, feel the chi circulating. Lift the shoulders, drop them down. Very good. Once more. And finish. Relax. From here, we're going to bounce the whole body. As I said, just keep things gentle. There is a lot of heat out there. There's a lot of young energy that is 
kind of want to expand all the time. So to balance it out, move softly, move with ease, move gently, trying to cultivate the in energy, the energy of the earth that can balance out all that heat from the outside. So very, very light, pleasant, focusing on opening, focusing on restoration and relaxation. Another trick that you can use is the water element. The water element helps to cool the fire. So imagine if you just walked into the water up until your neck and you feel as if your whole body is being rinsed through this beautiful crystal clear water. Feel free to close your eyes. Beautiful crystal clear water surrounding you and you feel yourself just rinsing through. Releasing any stagnation, any blocked energy, any feeling of stiffness, any debris or dirt that may be kind of stuck somewhere. Just rinse it all out, let it wash over. Your feet firmly positioning on the ground, the bottom of the sea. So you feel stable, you feel connected, but at the same time, quite nice, open, and light through your entire body. Cooling yourself down with a water element. Slow things down, maybe adjust your feet, come out of water and just feel the difference. A little lighter, a little bit more open, a little bit more spacious. We're going to do an exercise called Connect Heaven and Earth. This is a great exercise to stretch the meridians and the arms that are, have a direct link to our heart and our lungs, so it helps to balance the energy of the heart, helps to kind of move it better, move it more smoothly. So you can do that to cool yourself down during hot weather like this. We're going to begin by bringing both hands near the abdomen. There's many variations of this exercise. I like this one. We're going to lift just above the navel and separate the hands. One supporting the heavens, another one is pressing down onto the earth. Positioning yourself between the two forces. Nice opening. And then bring your hands back. Let them pass your heart center, cultivating the energy between your hands, connecting to the heart and open up again. Bringing that cool energy down as you exhale, open to stretch. Soft and bring yourself down. Inhale, feel your heart open. Exhale, feel the energy moving better. Inhale as you open. Exhale, softer. Find a way to move with your breath. Find a way to open your heart, allowing the energy to circulate better. Very good. Breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out.
One more time on each side, breathing in. Breathing out. Breathing in. And this time, bring your hand down. Relax in the chest, relax in the ribs, sinking your way down, letting the energy to flow downwards. Very good. The next exercise is called shake the head and move the tail or wag the tail. It's from the eight pieces of brocade and it's very good for balancing the energy of the heart because we're going to lift to expand and then relax to move across. So coming into the wider stance, using your hands for support, move your torso over your thigh and then lift your torso as if you're kind of peeking over the horizon, contracting the muscles of the back but at the same time opening, broadening your chest. Release as you move across, at the same time, wagging your tail behind to the other side. And again, lift and look across. You do want to feel your chest opens and your back contracting. Then you relax, chest parallel to the floor. Don't be afraid to use your arms to give you that support, especially if your back is sensitive. Moving across, on the inhale, lift. On the exhale, drop. Inhale, lift. Exhale, soften. Go easy on yourself, go easy on your lower back. Just if you're working with your heart particularly, just open your chest a little bit without arching your lower back too much. Stay cool, stay relaxed. Knowing your and understanding your body is number one success. Good. And let's do one more to the other side. Come back to center. Make your head up. And then come out. Adjusting your feet. If you, you felt it on the lower back, go ahead and massage a little bit. Relax. Good. And let's finish by taking deep, cooling breaths. Inhale, arms flow up. Exhale down. Inhale. Exhale. Make your breath slow and deep. You can visualize a waterfall, again, bringing the water element to balance out the heat of summer. Standing under the waterfall, beautiful crystal clear water washing over your body. It's taking away all the heat, all the excess heat, all the excess energy that the heat generates. Pour it out your feet, let it wash away. As you're enjoying those inhalations, feel the water flowing down your body, cooling you down. Wash it over your mind, wash it over your head, keep it cool. Wash it over your heart. Good. One more time. 
Rinse it through, rinse it over. Exhale, pour it down. Very good. Close your hands just below your belly. And finish your practice. Well, thank you for joining me today. I hope this was helpful. I hope you feel a little bit cooler, calmer, maybe just a little bit more relaxed to help you get through the summer heat that we're experiencing in Europe. So keep well, stay hydrated, and I'll see you soon. Thank you for joining me today. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to click a subscribe button so you don't miss any future videos or live streams. I wish you a great health and see you next time.